Welcome to Real Issue Podcast. I am your host, Martel Llewellyn. Guys, if you are an NBA fan, subscribe to the channel. If you're a Miami Heat fan, subscribe to the channel. Thank you for all the support. We're so close to 1,000 subs. Now, Max Strews pinpoints how the Miami Heat can fix their three-point issues and making their offense click. Now, he said in a report, it's just how we're getting the shots that we get, Strews said, while trying to explain the Heat shooting issues. That's the important thing for us and how we play. It's just we got to get more that are within the flow of the rhythm of the offense instead of forcing three-pointers and ones that are coming off ball screens at the end of the clock. I think if we come together more and have a better rhythm and flow offensively, I think we will all click. And I think he's right. I think that if we can get some more in-rhythm shots, this Miami Heat team will be great. I think it really just comes down to consistency. Can Max Struess... And Duncan Robinson, can they both be consistent shooters? I'm not saying they have to go 5 for 5 and 10 for 10, but I just think something that they both struggle with is that they have to be more consistent three-point shooters. I think Max Strews, he doesn't really get in his head. He can miss 10 shots and and still put up another one. I think Duncan Robinson, he's the one that kind of struggles with that whole mental battle and the whole mental side of being in a shooting slump. I think right now the Miami Heat, are starting to get out of the slump. Duncan Robinson of late has been playing better than Max Drews. I think that Max Drews has just been in a slump. Sometimes, like he said, they get a lot of shots that are closer to the end of the clock. You know, they got to throw up these clunky faraway threes. But one thing that Max Drews has to understand is that this is the NBA. You will not always get in rhythm shots, especially when you get closer to the playoffs and teams really have time to focus in on your game. They're not going to give you these in-transition threes, these in-rhythm threes, these step-into-the-shot threes. So I think that we have to continue to increase our ball movement. I think that will definitely help the Miami Heat. The Miami Heat have a really talented team. The problem is is that everything has to go right for the Miami Heat sometimes to be successful. So I just think that if Max Strews, Duncan Robinson, if they can continue to at least increase their level of play, hit a few more three-pointers... Last year, the Miami Heat were the best three-point shooting team in the NBA. So I know it's possible. Was somewhat of last year kind of like a you know like an anomaly type of thing? Yes. But I still know for a fact Duncan Robinson and Max Strews can shoot. I just think that they're going to have to get over the fact that they're not going to be in rhythm every single night. You're not always going to get those in-the-rhythm offensive three-point shots, those wide-open shots. It's just impossible. It's not going to happen every night. So for them, I just think it comes down to consistency. Can they support this starting core? Can they support this bench? Can they come in and at least hit a few threes, timely threes, in transition threes, tough threes? Because like I said, this is the NBA. You're not always going to get easy shots. But let me know what you guys think about Max Schuess. I just think that it comes down to ball movement and just shot creation. You're not always going to have these easy three-point looks. Let me know what you guys think in the comments. Like, share, comment, subscribe as we continue to push to 1,000 subscribers. 